Hello there guys, it's Diddy here, and I'm bringing you some 3v3 footage. I'm playing with an Affliction Warlock and a Holy Paladin, the Affliction is Gimli Head and X, I think you guys know him by now. <laughs> I don't know, maybe. And yeah, the Holy Paladin got to stick with us, and uh, I'm glad he did, he's, he's a really good guy and he plays really good, I like this composition too. And I hope I do more arenas with these guys, and to, to share to you, so... It's a really nice comp, I really like it. So we're facing a two two hunters and a holy paladin as well. Uh, Beastmaster in the markmanship, as you see here, he pops Stampede. I fear, and I don't know why it only gets two pets feared. This happens quite a lot, like, I don't know if it's a bug, but probably isn't because... Well, uh, it happens quite a lot. So, the hunter kites really good he almost got down there but the healer did a job and he did a pretty good kiting here so I'm forced to switch to to other ones so I decide to go on the hunter like as you see like our team is really getting pressure onto them as you see like the healer is pressured and that's really good that's one of the good things to have an affliction warlock in my opinion I think they do a pretty good job on you know getting a lot of pressure right here but yeah, I mean, and the hunter kites me really good too, I mean, hunters are kiting me really good. I don't know if you noticed, I had no charge there, so, I mean, it's 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 really bad, but, anyways, I'm, I'm here, I'm continually to pound on the hunter, and I see the holy paladin there with, you know, low health, and I decide to go there, get some pressure onto him, but he runs away, so I decide to switch. And I'm switching, I'm switching to the lowest health hunter, so it gives more pressure to the healer. Because he really have to art cast or his mate's gonna die. So it's always good if you want to go pressure. It's always good to go for the lowest health. So, you know, the paladin is quite low here. I decide to switch him, you know, if he dies it's, it's pretty nice. But um, yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen. I just missed the shockwave too. Uh, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> Anyways, the paladin was like almost I was just an execute away and he's down and he's down. Here it, it is, so now it is two hunter, but our healer is down too, so here it is. It's just me, the affliction warlock versus two hunters. This was a really interesting match, I really really enjoyed it. But uh yeah th they were a lot of low health than him than us, I mean, and the hunter goes down, so it's a win by here. <laughs> This one was a Frost Death Knight, a Holy Paladin, and an Arms Warrior. Now, this is scary. This is a comp that scared us, so we were just like waiting for them to push, and we were like seeing how it goes, so they did. They charge on the on my w Warlock, so I go to the Death Knight. I decide to go to the Death Knight. I tried to Shockwave the Warrior, but it kind of fails. I got feared, broke it and went to the death knight but i noticed that the warrior is popping his cooldowns and i don't want my warlock to get you know damage so i pop it he he disarms me it was a really good move by him i feared him but uh he breaks it so he's still trying to go to the warlock there i break a shivara cc but shit you know but we're getting a lot of pressure if you see like the warrior is really low the paladin is really low too this forced the paladin to bop the warrior he, did, he didn't break it and he bubbled himself this was kind of risky because he just wasted two cooldowns but i think it was a good move by them if it wasn't that the match would end way sooner than it did so yeah they they kind of recovered a little bit at least the warrior but the paladin did not have enough time to heal himself so i'm just pounding on him and yeah he's going to die so now it's just the warrior and the frost death knight obviously it's a win because you know we are at full health and they have no healer so yeah this was a really good one alright guys i hope you guys enjoyed it if you do please thumbs up and subscribe it does mean a lot guys I am so so appreciated for all the support I already gotten. It it was it isn't like the most you know thing ever like, but I for the thing I already have I am really really grateful. So you don't know how much it means to me. So please guys, if you liked it, you know it really helps a lot. So yeah, guys, see you next. Week.